to make sure there was no paper trail, was it not? Well, it doesn't look good, does it? Um, and, you know, the cover-up always always gets you, not, not always just the misconduct. Do you think we're ever going to get to the bottom of that? It's our intent to get to the bottom of it. You know, every time a text is sent, there's the sender and the person who receives the text. So we're going to track this down. We're going to use forensics. We're going to be going to the telecoms to see if they can recover this material uh, and the like. I mean, by the way, we don't know what's in it, but we fully expect to get or hope to get the um, all the text messages sent by uh, Mr. Jones, who just lost his uh, defamation case. Um, you know, we're going to find out, get to the bottom of this, and then let the American people know what we've found out. Well, I was just about to ask you about that. An attorney for the families of Sandy Hook victims says the January 6th committee and federal investigators have asked for Alex Jones's phone records who you just mentioned. Um, what, what do you want to look for in those records? Well, we know that uh, his uh, behavior did incent um, some of the January 6th um, conduct, uh, and we want to know uh, more about that. We don't know what we're going to find in the text because we haven't seen them, uh, mm -hmm. but we will look at it and learn more, I, I am sure.